you will remember this your entire life. It will affect how you meditate, how you read the scriptures. It will have a, a lasting influence for the good in your life. There's something about never knowing somebody well until maybe you've been to their home with them. That is where you really get to know somebody from their roots. And perhaps I say, I, I think now my relationship with Jesus is such that I know where you come from. I've had a few conversations since I've returned of people who are kind of unsure of whether they want to, attend, want to go to the Holy Land or asking me my thoughts on going to the Holy Land. And I, I've told them repeatedly, um, to me, there's not a safer place you're going to visit, not a holier place you're going to visit in the world. I think I'll never read or hear the Bible the same again because so many stories in the Gospels you have seen where it is. And so the whole Bible, all the Gospels to me are more personal now. How I just will feel so blessed to be able to have that the rest of my life. You know, each one of those moments, I don't think that I'll ever forget. So often when I will read certain scriptures now uh, at the end of Mass and the people will say, Father, were you thinking about uh, when we were in Israel? Were you thinking about when we were in Kephanu, uh, when we were in Nazareth, uh, when, when we were standing in the Jordan River? As I've looked over what I did, I, I, I've, my following and journey with Christ has grown so much um, that I, I can't understand why you wouldn't want to go on a trip like that. And why it's, it's almost like they I need to convince me why they shouldn't go rather than me convince them why they should go.